Parker Schnabel's journey on the gold rush has been remarkable. With his gold finds, he has proven himself to be a force to be reckoned with in gold exploration. Through monumental nuggets, daring gambles, and electrifying discoveries, Parker Schnabel and his team have made some of the most substantial gold finds ever. Join us as we unveil five of the biggest finds in Gold Rush. The unveiling of the 50-ounce nugget in Parker Schnabel's Eureka Venture. In the thrilling landscape of Gold Rush Season 7, Parker Schnabel embarks on the ambitious Eureka Project, a daring venture that unfolds across several episodes, showcasing the highs and lows of the relentless pursuit of gold. At the heart of this dramatic season lies the discovery of the monumental 50-ounce nugget, a find that symbolizes success and solidifies Parker's bold gamble on the challenging terrain of Eureka Creek. The stage is set in Episode 15, aptly titled The Eureka Gamble. Driven by a hunger for success, Parker takes a risky leap by expanding his mining operations at Eureka Creek, doubling his wash plant capacity. This pivotal decision sets the tone for the later discovery of the 50-ounce nugget, linking the narrative of risk-taking and potential reward. As the season progresses into episode 16, Eureka Payday becomes a likely candidate for unveiling the 50-ounce nugget. The episode promises a payday of epic proportions, suggesting a significant gold haul from Eureka Creek. The discovery of the colossal nugget takes center stage, leaving both Parker and viewers in awe of the substantial reward reaped from the Eureka Project. The season's climax, episode 17, King of Klondike, is a fitting finale to the Eureka venture. This episode typically summarizes the triumphs and setbacks of the entire season, making it a plausible platform to highlight the 50-ounce nugget alongside other notable achievements within Season 7. Viewers can expect a reflective look at Parker's journey, with the impressive nugget as a crowning jewel of his conquest of the challenging Klondike terrain. The significance of the 50-ounce nugget extends beyond its sheer weight. It becomes a symbol of triumph over adversity, a tangible representation of Parker's relentless pursuit of success in the unpredictable world of gold mining. With all its challenges and uncertainties, the Eureka Project proves that fortune truly favors the bold, and Parker Schnabel emerges as the King of Klondike, with the monumental nugget as his golden scepter. In the end, the discovery of the 50-ounce nugget within the intricate narrative of Gold Rush Season 7 adds a layer of excitement and accomplishment to Parker Schnabel's legacy. As viewers follow the highs and lows of the Eureka Venture, the unveiling of this impressive find becomes a pivotal moment, showcasing the rewards that come with those who dare to take the biggest gambles in the pursuit of Klondike Gold. The unveiling of Parker Schnabel's 41.8 ounces nugget. Gold Rush Season 10 unfolds with Parker Schnabel at the helm, navigating a landscape of new claims, family dynamics, and cutting-edge technological advancements. Amidst the hustle and bustle of mining operations, a standout moment emerges, the discovery of the electrifying nugget, a rare and uniquely valuable find that electrified both Parker and Gold Rush fans. The details surrounding the episode of this intriguing discovery are somewhat elusive, but it is likely to have occurred in the latter half of Season 10. The anticipation for significant finds peaked as Parker embarked on his quest to haul and expand operations across Klondike and Scribner Creek. Weighing in at approximately 41.8 ounces, the electrifying nugget earned its name from a mesmerizing dendritic crystal structure that resembled lightning bolts. This distinctive characteristic sets it apart, making it a rare geological wonder and adding a premium to its intrinsic gold value. While the exact episode remains a mystery, episode 14, Lightning Strikes Twice, provides an intriguing hint. Though the title may carry a metaphorical undertone, it could be a subtle nod to the discovery of the electrifying nugget alongside other notable finds, igniting a spark of excitement in the mining world. As the season progresses, the season finale, episode 15, titled Million Dollar Payday, emerges as a strong contender for showcasing the electrifying nugget. Season finales often serve as a platform to celebrate major achievements and significant hauls, and the electrifying nugget, with its unique appeal, could very well be a star attraction in Parker's successful season. For enthusiasts eager to delve deeper into the details, 
bonus content and online clips from Season 10 might unveil behind-the-scenes footage, offering a closer look at the moment Parker and his crew unearthed the electrifying nugget. These extras could provide a more intimate perspective on the excitement, awe, and meticulous process of extracting this extraordinary geological treasure. Ultimately, the electrifying nugget adds a dazzling chapter to Parker Schnabel's gold mining legacy. Its rarity and unique crystalline beauty elevate its market value and cement its place as a memorable and symbolic find within the rich tapestry of Gold Rush Season 10. Striking Gold in Klondike, Gold Rush Season 7 unfolds as Parker Schnabel embarks on a daring venture, leasing the vast and unmined Eureka Creek. Amidst the challenges of equipment failures, fluctuating gold yields, and the inherent risks of unexplored terrain, Parker's determination and strategic vision lay the foundation for an extraordinary chapter of the Klondike gold mining saga. The initial episodes of Season 7 provide a gritty portrayal of Parker's struggles at Eureka Creek. From battling equipment issues to navigating unpredictable gold yields, the young miner faces the harsh realities of the mining world. Undeterred, Parker invests in cutting-edge machinery and fine-tunes his operations, setting the stage for a dramatic turnaround. Around the mid-season mark, viewers witness a remarkable transformation as Parker's efforts at Eureka Creek begin to bear fruit. In a departure from the typical gold mining narrative, no singular monumental nugget steals the spotlight. Instead, a sustained period of impressive gold recovery ensues, earning the moniker Eureka Creek Bounty. Episodes like Eureka Payday and the season finale, King of Klondike, become the crescendo of this bounty. Parker consistently recovers substantial amounts of gold, exceeding expectations and surpassing his previous hauls. The joy is palpable as the team celebrates the culmination of their hard work and perseverance. What sets the Eureka Creek bounty apart is its significance as a turning point for the entire season. Parker's consistent gold recovery proves the viability of Eureka and solidifies his position as a leader in the competitive world of gold mining. The sustained success allows him to expand his operations, invest in new and improved equipment, and even explore side ventures beyond the confines of Eureka Creek. The narrative unfolds as a testament to strategic planning, unwavering perseverance, and the ability to adapt to challenges in the unpredictable realm of gold mining. Parker's journey at Eureka Creek goes beyond the allure of individual nuggets, illustrating the profound impact of sustained success and the ripple effects it created by the mining community. As viewers witness the Eureka Creek bounty, they are drawn into the excitement and triumph of Parker Schnabel's journey. The season becomes a celebration of resilience, innovation, and the relentless pursuit of gold, showcasing that in the Klondike, sometimes the most valuable treasure is not a singular nugget, but a sustained bounty that transforms the fortunes of a daring miner. 100 ounces gold in Scribner Creek. In the latest episode of the riveting gold mining saga, Parker Schnabel, the tenacious young miner, sets his sights on a potentially game-changing gold vein in the depths of Scribner Creek. The stakes are high and the excitement is palpable as Parker and his crew tirelessly dig through layers of gravel, driven by the anticipation of a life-altering discovery. The narrative takes a thrilling turn when, after days of relentless effort, the crew unveils a massive rock housing what appears to be a monster nugget. With an estimated weight of around 100 ounces, the nugget tantalizingly holds the promise of a windfall, potentially worth over $200,000. The atmosphere is electric as the team carefully chips away at the surrounding rock, revealing more of the golden treasure beneath. However, the fickle nature of gold mining rears its head with a heartbreaking twist. During the delicate excavation process, the monster nugget fractures into smaller, less valuable pieces, shattering the crew's dreams of a record-breaking find. Despite the setback, the episode highlights Parker's resilience and determination in adversity. The emotional roller coaster continues as viewers witness the highs and lows of the mining world. The initial thrill of discovery gives way to the somber moment of the Nugget's fragmentation, leaving Parker and his crew to grapple with the harsh reality of the industry. The camaraderie and teamwork displayed by the crew during this unexpected challenge become a testament to their collective spirit and shared commitment to the unpredictable pursuit of gold. Amidst the central storyline, 
the episode weaves into other intriguing narratives, including Tony Beats's struggles with thawing permafrost, showcasing the myriad challenges miners face beyond the quest for gold. Rick Ness, too, takes center stage as he explores a new claim, adding layers of excitement and uncertainty to the overarching narrative. The episode becomes a canvas for philosophical discussions about luck and perseverance in the unforgiving world of gold mining. As Parker reflects on the shattered dream of the monster nugget, viewers are invited to contemplate the fine line between success and failure in an industry where every scoop of dirt holds the potential for fortune or despair. In the end, King Midas Touch emerges not only as a captivating episode of gold mining drama, but also as a poignant reminder of the relentless pursuit of dreams, the unpredictable nature of success, and the indomitable spirit that keeps miners like Parker Schnabel going, even when faced with the crushing disappointment of fractured gold. The epic journey of the 83.8 ounces Cripple Creek Nugget. Embarking on an adventure that would leave an unforgettable mark on Gold Rush Season 5, Parker Schnabel's quest for gold takes a captivating turn in the story of the legendary Cripple Creek Nugget. Across a series of gripping episodes, viewers are treated to a narrative of resilience, discovery, and the relentless pursuit of fortune. The saga begins in Episode 8, aptly titled Cripple Creek Caper Parker, not wavered by the challenges of collapsed tunnels and equipment failures, ventures into the depths of the abandoned mine. This initial exploration sets the stage for the defining chapter of his gold mining career. The episode shows the ups and downs of searching for gold, hinting about the amazing things that will happen next. The peak of the story happens in episode 14, fittingly titled The Big One. Tension mounts as Parker and his dedicated crew meticulously follow the promising gold vein leading to the climactic moment of the Cripple Creek Nugget's revelation. Weighing in at an astonishing 83.8 ounces, the Nugget becomes an instant symbol of victory, and the sheer scale of the find leaves both the crew and viewers in awe. Episode 15, Gold Rush Fever, takes the story to new heights as news of the Cripple Creek Nugget spreads like wildfire. The abandoned mine transforms into a battleground as rival miners flock to the area, sparking a gold rush of epic proportions. Now faced with the challenges of increased competition, Parker navigates the complexities of strategic negotiations and the relentless pursuit of maintaining his claim amidst the burgeoning chaos. Memorable moments abound throughout this captivating narrative. The dramatic reveal of the Cripple Creek Nugget emphasizing its size and weight becomes an iconic moment in Gold Rush history. Parker's genuine reaction of joy and disbelief at the monumental find resonates with audiences, humanizing the high-stakes world of gold mining. However, the story doesn't just focus on the glittering prize. It delves into the technical challenges and the unyielding teamwork required to extract and process such a colossal nugget. The Cripple Creek Nugget becomes more than a mere discovery. It symbolizes the culmination of perseverance, hard work, and the unrelenting pursuit of dreams in the unforgiving world of gold mining. In the end, the tale of the Cripple Creek Nugget is a testament to the enduring spirit of gold miners, the allure of uncharted territories, and the insatiable quest for glory in the heart of the Klondike. As the season unfolds, viewers are left on the edge of their seats, eager to witness the next chapter in Parker Schnabel's extraordinary journey through the gold-laden landscapes of Cripple Creek. Which of the discoveries discussed today do you find most intriguing? Let us know in the comments section. Remember to like and subscribe for more intriguing videos. Thanks for watching. See you next time.